Hi, what a fantastic evening. Um, I'm so inspired by so much of what I'm hearing. It's so good that everybody's speaking from their hearts. I am thrilled to be here tonight to present to this extraordinarily talented human being, Christian Louboutin. I have talked a lot in interviews about how I never really know who a character is until I know what shoe she wears because the shoe you wear defines how you stand in the world and how you walk in the world. And so until I can place the shoe for a woman, whether it's a flip-flop or a Louboutin, that tells me who she is and how she feels about herself. But for me, I discovered you at a time when I was looking for a character that was much more personal. Um, it was a time when I was learning about fashion and I had relied on a lot of friends to teach me about red carpets because I knew that this was an important part of what I do. Um, and so I began an education in fashion searching for red carpet carry, searching for who I am when I'm out there in the world standing behind my work. And when I slipped on my first red sole, I knew who I was in that world. I knew how to be bigger than myself and yet still myself. And that's what your shoes do. They elevate who we are inside and out. You make us taller as women in our hearts and in our closets, and we are forever grateful. That red sole is so perfect because it represents blood and love and fire and passion. It represents all that you are as an artist and all that we dream to be as human beings. I'm so grateful that you helped me to find myself. And I always know when I need to feel my most secure, I will feel my most secure when I'm floating on a pair of red soles. Um, I was saying out there that my mother, um, Last year at the Oscars when I presented, I was, I don't know, like 12 months pregnant. And, um, and I insisted on wearing Louboutins. And my mother said she held her breath the whole time because she couldn't believe, you know, her nightmare was that I would trip and fall and what would that mean? And I said, no, I'll, I'll be fine because I knew with you, I had nothing to worry about. Your shoes are so beautifully crafted that I will always be in balance when I'm with you. So it's an honor to be here. I'm so thrilled to present to you, everyone, Mr. Christian Lubitow. Thank you, Gary. Um, <clears throat> um, two or three things I should say about myself. I'm French. <laughs> so that's one thing. So two or three things I should say about French. We don't, we haven't been educated in some ways. You never give speeches. You never, at school, you never do that. You, you, you never speak, you know. You shout, you're not happy. But you never speak. And, um, and at college, as I was saying to Kerry, you don't give speeches neither. I didn't do college anyway, but I know that no one, <coughs> so. That's one thing about French. The second thing about French is that they're pretty stubborn, which I am totally too. And so, for instance, OK, you are going to be there tonight, etc. So you, you prepare yourself to say something. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then, of course, you forget. That's very French. So I did not prepare anything, and I feel terrible now. It's been half an hour that I'm thinking, oh, god, everybody's been talking and having things to say and to prepare the thing. What am I, what am I, what am I going to do? So, thank God my, my English is very limited. I have very few vocabulary. I counted with a friend of mine, I had uh, over 300 words, that's it. So, I already used at least 200. <laughs> that should be uh, short. But, Kerry, I have to say one thing. When I'm designing shoes, when I'm designing women's shoes, I'm thinking of women. And I'm thinking, I'm not necessarily thinking of a specific woman, I mean with a name on, but I'm always thinking of 
Number one, I don't dress up. I'm not a designer, I'm just doing shoes, so she's naked. <laughs> True, she's naked. And with shoes. And, and so she has an attitude, she has different attitudes. She's quite powerful. She loves more anything else. She loves more than anything else. Well, that's my English. To be a woman, she's very happy to be a woman, and and she's beautiful. So all these things you have. So I'm very very happy that you introduced me tonight and you give me other words and I'm not forgetting. <laughs> if it's mine, if it's mine. And uh, so thank you very much, Kerry. Now. Um, now I'm French again, and uh, so for, for a little while, for two weeks, French is in a very complicated thing. So I am, je suis Charlie, okay, that's what we've been saying. And, uh, but, but tonight, je suis pas Charlie, je suis Daily, et puis je suis Kerry. Voilà, thank you. Oh.